National and international news have picked up the supposed video nasty. I will put my neck on a block and say that the supposed video nasty is completely that, supposed. Dan, I'm telling you that the video you saw was not what you think it was. It was an old video, it was doing the rounds before. This is not what you think, Dan. Okay, welcome to Aldon's Reviews and True Crime. So in my view, to cut a long story short, it's rubbish. I do feel sorry for the family. Again, Dan, you didn't know, but what are you putting the family through? It's not good because this video, it was a short video, it was an old video. You're not keeping up to date. With the press picking up on the armchair detectives, it's not in a good light and it doesn't hold any of us in a good light. Armchair detectives. They've picked up cases before and they've solved them. Of that or which, it sparks interest. And the authorities in the past have looked into these cases and they've solved them. They put them before the police, the courts, and people have been prosecuted, found out, and everything has come clean. So therefore, we've got to be very careful what we put out and not be so positive on what we see unless we know that it is actually what we're looking at. So I'm putting my neck on the line and I would say we haven't heard anything from Dan because he's got nothing else to report. He saw a video, it looked very much like Jay <clears throat> and I do accept that it did look like Jay, but it wasn't. It wasn't Jay, so therefore there is nothing else to report along the lines of a video. There are lots of other unanswered questions and we need those questions answered and we need an investigation opened up. I won't go on again about the phones, but the phones of absolutely everybody involved, every searcher, every friend needs to be looked at. Now we don't need to have the phones in front of us. We can look at the data, okay? They, the authorities, the experts can look at the data surrounding all the pings of the phones of where they've been and whereabouts. The other things I think that are true, the connections of underworld or seedy uh, places that some of these characters have been to or they're connected with, that needs to be opened up. Now for the sake of Warren Slater, he has been posting videos. They are older videos, so I was right. They were older videos that he posted at the time he was visiting there and he has unanswered questions. So this needs to be looked at as well, doesn't it? All these unanswered questions that even the family are asking. So Warren and the family do have our support and they know that we mean well. I'll leave you with a video that Warren posted when he went searching for Jay and the speculative sort of nature that he expressed and my heart goes out to the family as I say again and my heart goes out to, to everybody involved really and I thank everyone for commenting please continue to comment you can email me and you can put in the comments any new information that you might have okay thank you and remember please don't have any nasty dreams thank you for watching to confirm that this is my account. Uh, I haven't been back to Tenerife ever since I came back from looking for my son. Uh, the videos that I've been posting are just documentation of what I was up to, where I was searching, things I was looking at while I was out there. And that's it. She records the of that mountain. It drops us back down to that valley, which I no, don't can believe I think, because they all look the same. Um, I was Jay Clown in that eye, and scale down the other side. And it's just all wild goose chases. I 
didn't realize what that was. Where did you start walking? So, she doesn't want to live. I always thought that was you. Previously, we're in the door of the Explorer seconds. He's supposed to be stuck over the top of that mountain, which is like five miles away. And she's taking us down a country path, going downwards, which is, like I said, five miles away. Now, if he's climbed 20,000 feet from the other side, and he's supposed to have come down here, like I said, got more chance of finding Cleopatra. Oh, sorry, and I forgot to report that this is supposed to take us to Las Cristianas, a nine hour walk. Now, the main road is there. Can you see where the bridge is? That's the main road. So, Jay has come all the way over 47 mountain peaks, come all the way down here. He's found this path, and she says if he'd looked at his Google Maps, which died four hours ago at the top of that mountain, if he's found, if he's remembered that this path leads to Los Cristianos, and it's a nine hour walk. Seriously? Right, and I forgot to say. I wonder if this is the path that he took to go and buy some cigarettes and then he was going back to the bed and breakfast where he started off from. But who knows? Some of these people in my search party I believe in Dora. I don't think she knows herself. But <laughs> Hang on, we've got some signposts down here. But I think Zach had Jay managed to nip on one of the mouses if he's come this way. Only saying the logic thinking but hey well hang on oh maybe I oh that's a good sign isn't it this path is closed no entry Right, we've been walking for half an hour into the middle of God knows where. We're just covered with mountains. And don't know where we're heading. And as you can see, there's nothingness.